All right, Kuspitsky Humoresque is in the key of G, and it's based on the G major arpeggio. And it goes in, it covers all three octaves of the G string. Okay, to get started, uh, do this warm up with me. This will get your body moving through the range of the bass and discovering the natural balance of the instrument so that your hand is free to move through the range. Okay, so you have uh, open G and then B with your first finger and then pivot to the D with your fourth finger and back. of G. All right. Now once you can do that, then go up to the second octave. Shift in the thumb, G, B with the second finger, and the D with your third finger harmonic. Shift the fourth finger. Four. One. Open. All right, here's the whole range. It's not really quite on my shoulder. It's just just touching the shirt material in my in my shoulder. But what I'm doing is I'm making sure that the bass rolls forward on the end pin against my hip, that it goes towards the bow to keep the weight in my fingers and not back here in my thumb, or you'll be catching the instrument. Okay. And roll. And it's catching the top of the bass right here under my forearm. Stand up. Bend your knees, push your hips back. to the bow will be more on the A string than it is on the G string. It's all about the uh, balance. You'll feel it. Roll into the bow, shift to thumb, knees, hips, and back, knees and hips back. Stand up on the thumb. Okay. Back to the G string. Now let's extend to this high G. Knees bend, 
front, hips back, base neck on your shirt sleeve, G, B, and then shift to the thumb on this D. No, I take that back. Third finger here, then shift to your thumb on this high note. And then back. Why thumb? Because you want to have access to all the rest of them in the same position. Okay, the whole string now. Bend your knees, hips back. Two, three, thumb. This is G. Now these are all harmonics. B. D, and skip the seventh, go right to the octave. Keep the bow close to the bridge. So there's lots of work here to do. I would just spend another 20 minutes, 20 or 30 minutes, just doing this one string arpeggio exercise, this three octave arpeggio, okay?